the fountain of youth isn't something you can buy. Rather, the secret is all about living a physically active life. And here is the proof. There's no pill that is gonna make you look 20 years younger. I'm sorry. It does not exist. I'm going to change your mindset completely. Okay, ready? If we look at the first picture, we can see the muscle mass and the adipose tissue, meaning the fat mass of a 40-year-old triathlete. Very physically active. The dark tissue is muscle. See how much muscle mass there is. And he's not 20. He's 40. So if you notice, there is very little fat mass or adipose tissue. So, high lean mass and very little fat mass. Ideal. And then if we look at the second picture, it's from a 74-year-old sedentary man. I repeat, sedentary. And let me make myself smaller. Okay. Just look at the muscle mass. It's so small. And then look at the fat mass. The less lean mass you have, the more fat mass you will have. And we know that's not good for health. Just compare the 40-year-old to the 74-year-old sedentary man. And do not, do not tell me it's because one is 40 and the other 74. I'm going to totally ruin your argument right now. I am. <laughs> Look at the third picture. 70-year-old triathlete. Look at the muscle mass. See how little fat mass he has and how much muscle mass he has. Lean mass. Just compare the 40-year-old to the 70-year-old. Yes, your lean mass. So, your bone mass and your muscle mass is going to decrease with age. However, if you stay active, here is the proof. You can preserve lean mass. It's your choice. Your bone mass is going to decrease with age. That's a fact. We have a steady growth until our 20s. But then after our 30s, look what happens. And yes, there is a difference between males and females. Males have a higher bone mass than women. And there is a peak of bone mass in our mid-30s. And there is a big, big bone loss due to menopause. Women, I know. I know. And that's why it's so important you stay active after menopause. If you stay active throughout your entire lifespan, this chart is going to be completely different. So yes, you can defy fate if you stay active. If you don't stay active, you are going to lose bone density and bone mass. And your bones are going to be more fragile. And you're going to get injured more easily. And if you do injure yourself, it's going to be harder for you to recover. That's why it's so important you have strong, strong, strong bones. I want you to use weights. Cardio is not going to be enough. I want you to use weights. We need to build bone mass. I want you to start lifting weights. No excuses. I'm going to be watching. I'm going to be watching. I'll be watching. I don't want you to be a lazy ass bitch and lay on the couch. You're not gonna get anywhere. You're gonna get nowhere and you're gonna have fragile bones so remember you're gonna be a nobody with fragile bones so a nobody with fragile bones falling all the time full of injuries is that the future you want that's a pretty sad fate if you ask me future not looking right <laughs> Think about it.